Hello friends, I am Anik. Welcome to our TechMaker YouTube channel. In this video, we will discussing MWM generator and answering some of the most commonly asked interview questions about them. MWM generators are renowned for their reliability and efficiency, making them a popular choice for power generation in a wide range of industry. So whether you are an aspiring engineer looking to expand your knowledge or a session professional seeing to refresh your understanding, this video is sure to provide you valuable insight into MWM generator and the engineering principle behind them. Let's get started the video. Question number one. What is MWM generator and how does it work? Answer. An MWM generator is a type of generator that uses an internal combustion engine to convert fuel into mechanical energy, which is then converted to electrical energy using a generator. The MWM generator is known for its reliability, efficiency, and durability. Question number 02. How do you determine the size of an MWM generator needed for a specific application? Answer. The size of an MWM generator needed for a specific application is determined by calculating the total power requirement of the equipment that will be powered by the generator. This calculation takes into account the peak power demand and the continuous power demand of the equipment. Question number 03. How do you maintain an MWM generator? Answer. MWM generator requires regular maintenance to ensure they operate efficiently and reliably. Maintenance tasks may include well and filter change, fuel system check, cooling system check, and periodic inspection of the engine and generator component. Question number 04. What is the role of a voltage regulator in an MWM generator? Answer. The voltage regulator in an MWM generator is responsible for maintaining a consistent voltage output regardless of the load on the generator. This helps to ensure that the electrical equipment being powered by the generator receive a stable and reliable source of power. Question number 05. What is the difference between a standby generator and a prime power generator? Answer. A standby generator is designed to provide backup power in the event of a output or other emergency situation. A prime power generator is designed to provide continuous power for extended period of time and is typically used in application where a reliable source of electricity is needed for long period such as remote mining operation or oil and gas exploration. Question number 06. What is the typical lifespan of an MWM generator? Answer: The lifespan of an MWM generator can vary depending on a number of factors including uses patterns, maintenance practice and operating condition. However, with proper maintenance and care, an MWM generator can last for 20 years or more. Question number 07. How do you troubleshoot a generator that is not producing power? Answer. There are several potential causes for a generator that is not producing power, including a malfunction voltage regulator, a faulty alternator, or a fuel system issue. Troubleshooting this issue may involve checking the electrical connection, inspecting the fuel system component and performing diagnostic 
test on the generator component. Question number 08. What is the difference between a diesel generator and natural gas generator? Answer. Diesel generator use diesel fuel as primary fuel source, while natural gas generator use natural gas. Diesel generators are typically more efficient and have longer lifespan, but natural gas generators are cleaner burning and produce fewer emissions. Question number 09. What is the role of a transfer switch in a generator system? Answer. The transfer switch in a generator system is responsible for automatically transferring the load from the utility power source to the generator in the event of a power outage. This helps to ensure that critical equipment and system remain operational during an outage. Question number 10. What safety measure should be taken when operating an MWM generator? Answer. Safety measure when operating an MWM generator may include wearing appropriate personal protective equipment, following proper fuel handling procedure, and ensuring that the generator is installed and maintained according to manufacturer specification. Additionally, generator should never be operated indoors or in an enclosed space, as they produce carbon monoxide which can be deadly in high concentration. Question number 11. What are the main advantages and disadvantages of using an MWM generator compared to other type of generators? Answer. Some advantages of using an MWM generator include high reliability, efficiency, and durability. Disadvantages may include higher initial costs compared to other type of generator and potentially more maintenance requirement. Question number 12. How does the fuel system of an MWM generator work and what are the some common issues that can occur? Answer. The fuel system of an MWM generator typically include a fuel tank fuel pump, fuel filter, and fuel injectors. Common issues that can occur include clock fuel filter, fuel contamination, and fuel pump failure. Question number 13. What is the difference between single phase and three phase power and which is typically used in MWM generator? Answer. Single phase power is a type of alternating current that uses one wire to deliver power where three phase power uses three wire. MWM generator typically use three phase power which provide more efficient power delivery and allow for higher power output. Question number 14. How do you calculate the fuel consumption of an MWM generator and what factor can affect fuel consumption? Answer. Fuel consumption of an MWM generator can be calculated by measuring the amount of fuel used over a specific period of time and dividing it by power output of the generator. Factor that can affect fuel consumption include load demand, generator size, and operating condition. Question number 15. What is the role of the governor in an MWM generator and how does it work? Answer. The governor is an MWM generator is responsible for regulating the speed of the engine in response to change its load demand. This helps to ensure that the generator provides a stable and reliable source of power. The governor works by controlling the fuel injection and engine speed. Thank you for watching our video and we hope it helps you in your dream job search. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more informative video of mechanical technology and other related topics. 
see you soon our next video thank you